Alexa, open Mastering Phrasal Verbs. Welcome to Mastering Phrasal Verbs. This game is about identifying the meaning of phrasal verbs and learning their usage in sentences. But first, would you like to know what phrasal verbs are? No. Seems like you'll do just fine without a beginner's lesson. If you feel like you need one, just say teach me about phrasal verbs. Shall we begin the game now? Yes. Okay. Which game would you like to play? You can choose from pick a phrasal or fill up the blank. Pick a phrasal. I, Captain. Here's how this challenge goes. In the question, you will be given the meaning of a phrasal verb. All you need to do is pick the correct phrasal verb with that meaning from the options. You can answer by saying A or B. Every correct answer is worth a point. Ready to begin? Yeah. All right. Here we go. Select the phrasal verb that expresses the meaning. To postpone. A. Put on. B. Put off. B. Correct. Choose the phrasal verb that conveys the meaning. To give information or advice to someone. A. Hand in. B. Hand out. A. That's the wrong answer. The correct answer is option B. Hand out. Pick out the phrasal verb that means forcefully enter into a building. A. Break in. B. Break up. A. You're doing great. You scored two points in this set. Shall we play some more? Switch level. You have switched to fill up the blank. The catch here is to fill the blank space in the given sentence using one of the phrasal verbs from the options. Give your answer by saying A or B. You'll score one point for every right answer. Ready to begin? Yeah. Here goes. I must blank to the consequences of my bad decisions. A. Own up. B. Opt out. A. That's right. We got to blank this meeting as soon as possible. A. Wrap round. B. Wrap up. A. Sorry, that's not correct. The correct answer is option B. Wrap up. You scored one point in this set. Shall we play some more? No. Do you want to switch to pick a phrasal? No. All right. Your total score is three points. Come back soon, and we'll catch up on more phrasal verbs. Goodbye.